Hello everyone, welcome back to my page. So today's video will be showing you the shower that we threw from my sister a year ago on December 3rd, 2021. It's going to be a three-part series where I show you all the decor um, that I created for the shower and then at the very end you'll see everything put together in one quick video. So it was in the midst of COVID so we just decided to have it at my home. Only a small amount of people participated in person. Everybody else was on Zoom. The theme was called Ariel's Winterest Wonderland. Ariel is my niece. So please enjoy the video and let me know what you think down in the comments. Hello everyone. I hope you all are doing well. So today I am here to do some videos for my niece's baby shower. Uh, she will be here January 30th. We are so excited. So I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to show you some of the crafts that I'm going to incorporate for decor at the shower. So it is entitled Ariel's Wondrous Winter Wonderland. So obviously her name is Ariel. Um, and my sister came up with the Wonderland, with the, excuse me, winter uh, Wonderland theme. So I just put all of that together and that's how we got the title and so then we chose the colors pink white and silver that's why I wore my pink um top so that way I could represent for the shower and so I've incorporated all of this into the crafts so which will turn into the decor so what I'm going to do is I am going to um break the videos up um separately for each craft so you will see them after the shower so what I'm gonna do is there will be a video with the final product of the shower once we you know, put everything together. Um, <clears throat> and that's gonna be a part of the 35 for 35 design series. And then I'll do these crafts as additional bonus crafts. They'll be their own uh, series, which will be the baby shower series. Cause I'll have a series of videos, not just the crafts. Or some other ones. Oops, look at me, I'm about to break the glass. Okay, so. Before I get started, I just want to show you what three crafts I'm working on um, <clears throat> so you all just know what videos to expect. So the first one being the candle holders. They, of course, are from the dollar store. So we're going to be using some silver spray um, and the candles. So that's one project. The second project is for the card table. Um, and so I wanted the centerpiece on the card table. So this is, I'll be putting this together. You'll see what I'm gonna do with this. And then the final uh, design will be the main um, piece. This is gonna be for our centerpiece. I'm really excited about this. I'm gonna use this and this piece for the blank. So yes, those are the three crafts that I'm gonna work on. Again, look for the additional additional videos and they will come out after uh, the shower. So I'm excited. I hope you all enjoy it. I cannot wait. We're so happy for her arrival and I will see you all soon. Okay, everybody, so now I'm here to do um, my first craft from the shower. So we're gonna do it here um, at my home. It's actually two parts, so there's going to be a drive through and only a very small amount of people will be um, allowed inside due to COVID. My sister's really, uh, she's been very strict about COVID, and so, you know, just to protect her and her baby and her partner, uh, that's how we're going to do it. So, um, my home is not that large, but it's, it's enough space where we can still try and create the theme that she wanted. So... I am going to um, use my main table, obviously, is the, the table with place settings and things. So, of course, I need a, I need a centerpiece. So, that's the first uh, decor piece I am going to create. So, let me show you what I'm going to be using. So, first thing, oops, actually, this is not the Let's do that over there. The first thing is, obviously, this face. You've seen it in several other videos, but today I'm going to transform it. Um... And again, I somebody gave this to me. They gave me flowers, and so I kept the base. I'm going to do use a flower ball. I got this from a store uh, in Security Mall. It's called Party Craft. I absolutely love it. Party City is great, but Party Craft has a variety of um, decor pieces and party uh, decorations that you're not going to find anywhere else, even Party City. And they're also fairly reasonable. So this was, they had this in like these flower balls and 
several colors and several sizes so i think i got like the medium size so obviously it's like pink roses and it's just the um cord so we're gonna use that and then this little tutu i got from amazon i think it was like ten dollars or something like this so it comes with the little tutu so cute right and then the headpiece so after uh the shower i'm gonna let my sister have it uh so baby ariel could can wear it and then of course we want our vase to look nice so we're gonna bling bling it out um i got this um from amazon uh just crystal rhinestones nothing special and i just got the the clear ones um and i'm like this is clear slash silver so it matches our colors okay so let's start so um, what I'm going to do is, let me see, this is 0.59 inches uh, wide. So, let's see how best we can do this. Now, this will be my first time using crystal, so let's have fun. Okay, so first, let me do this. Just measure it. Try and get it right under me. I think we're good to cut it here. I should have cut my strips before I started. I wasn't thinking. Uh, okay. Here's my piece. Let's see. Did I cut it right? Oh, am I a little short? It's a little short, but um, we'll make it work, right? Okay. All right. So, of course, got our nice E6000 glue. Oh, gosh. Make sure I didn't. So, I'm just going to put it on the, on the back. The glue decides that it wants to come out. Um, they had this in like a, this, this as they call it, bling. It's funny, you put in bling and you get the crystal rhinestones. Um, but they had this in a couple different colors. And I was like, perfect that you all had the color that I needed. So, ooh, now don't be like me and stick it on your Try and stick yourself with the glue. Okay, so the goal is to get this directly underneath the bottom of the of this pull it yeah I cut it a little short but that's fine oh wait I was able to stretch it look look at God okay. oh so you can stretch this because it definitely was looking like there was a big chunk <laughs> left out okay so again, just going around to just make sure that it's exactly where I want it to be placed, right underneath the very top. Again. Okay, I think I got it. So that's my first row. Okay, all right, so I don't want to bore you all and show you how to do this whole thing. This video will be very long. So I'm going to finish putting the rest of this on and then I'll come back. Okay, everybody, I have finally finished um, with the vase. I'm so happy with how it turned out. Ah, look at the, look at the bling. So it was my first time using this. Try to get it as close as possible. You all probably can't see it. Thank God. Um, but yeah, I had to use... I actually bought a second pack of the uh, Crystal Rhinestones. Thank God. Because halfway down, it, it was... Uh, I ran out of the, the first one. So it's fine. I, I, I did it. Gorgeous. Silver. And our color scheme. Now let's finish up the, um, the centerpiece. And again, it's going to go on this table. Of course, this whole table will be decorated placemats, tablecloth, all of that. Um, but I just wanted to complete this first. Okay, so now, as you can see, this is the vase. So that's, of course, not a complete look. So here's the tutu. It's 
So let me set this right here. down as possible okay and then hopefully y'all can oops, sorry I'm trying to bring it down so y'all can really see it okay and then we're gonna see that's our little head pieces and that's so cute trying to get it as far from the tutu as possible All right, and now the final piece, the final piece. Put it in and bam, isn't that gorgeous? That is our centerpiece. So let me just bring out the Lazy Susan so you all can see what it's gonna look like. Guess we should make sure that this is. Okay, now, ooh, ooh where's my other shoe? Oh, okay. So. I could be finished with it, but I was like, I feel like it's missing a little something. So I went to Burlington and I got these cute little shoes. They're Minnie Mouse shoes. I just wanted silver, but then I found this combination with like silver and then the pink. Some little colors in it, but it's still within our color scheme. So let's put this on the side. So, is that this? See right here? And that is the centerpiece. Isn't that so cute? So, of course, um, once I am um, finished uh, with the whole table, I will show you. But that's what we have so far. I am so proud of myself. Well, let me move the, the mess out the way. But that way you all can see it. So, um, it was quick and easy. The hardest part was just the crystals. Trying to make sure that I put enough glue and then I um, cut the right size. And thank God it was stretched. It stretched. So even if I was off a little bit, I could always kind of push it together. There are a few little pieces that are, uh, you can see where it's like uneven, but most people won't notice it. Um, only I will know. Um, but that's it. So that's the first video, the centerpiece. I'm so excited. Uh, the more of these I do, the more excited I get about the shower. So again, I'll post this later and I will see you in the next video for the next design. Okay, everybody, so I am back to um, do the second um, design piece for the baby shower. Um, okay, so I am going to have a card table, um, and I wanted to put some decor on it outside of the card. So um, there'll be some glasses, but I want it kind of like a main uh, centerpiece again outside of the box. So this is going to be like quick and easy. So it's going to be this vase which again uh, somebody got me flowers and so I kept the vase because you just never know what you'll need it for so it's gonna be this and then these artificial flowers where you know where I always shop the dollar store and I'm sorry and this one came from Hobby Lobby but it was 99 cents so this isn't quite the other colors of pink but you know I thought it was cute <laughs> <laughs> so we will put this on the table and of course what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my uh, metallic finish uh, the silver color uh, so I'm going to paint uh, spray paint this uh, and then I will come back and we will put it all together all right I'll see you in a few okay everybody so I am back um, with my uh vase centerpiece design for the card table so here is the metallic spray painted vase isn't it so pretty okay so now i'm ready to uh, put the final touches on just turn the camera this way okay so of course like i said i got all of these with the exception of this one from hobby lobby everything else um came from the dollar tree it's so pretty it's got our pink rose gold and um, and then the silver. Okay, so then let's just put it together. Okay. So actually, I think I like starting with the silver first. Sure. I'm going to throw in our little pink here and there.
Okay. This is we can see. This is kind of falling. Okay, let me see. It's one, it's one piece. Okay. I think we got it. You know, I, and I spray painted it because I'm like, oh, it was clear and you would see the green. And you'll still see some of the green, but just not as much now. Okay. All right. And that's it. That's the final piece. Isn't it beautiful? Okay. So I will show you um, once I put the, heart, the whole um, card table to, together, you will see this piece on that table. So, all right. I will be back with my next design.